I have made sure that though the dollar is high, but it is available. Mheshimiwa Rais, eh, katika siku kuu ya Jamhuri ulisema kwamba uchumi wa taifa umeimarika kabisa siku chache kabla ya hotuba yako. Naibu Rais Rigathi Gashagwa alikuwa amesema huende kachukua muda hata takriban miaka kumi hivi katika kushughulikia masuala muhimu ya wananchi. Wakati fulani Waziri wa Fedha Henry Rotich akasema kwamba hapana Njuguna Waziri wa Fedha eh, Njuguna Ndungu akasema kwamba hali ni ngumu kwa taifa hasa kulipa eh, mishahara na masuala mengine ambayo yanohusiana na fedha. Hali ya uchumi kwa vipi mheshimiwa rais na, na hii Tukisalia hapo tukisalia hapo uh, Prime Sears Musalemu Dawadi amesema three years you know to quote him verbatim, team is forecasting a difficult two to three years asking Kenyans to bear the burden. So just like um, Kitu here is asking, do we, during your manifesto launch, Mr. President, you called it the plan. Is there a plan there for economic plan? recovery? Because you are saying this, your deputy is saying another thing, um, Treasury CS, a different thing, mm -hmm. Prime Cabinet Secretary, I mean, this should be one government that Nani is in one voice. Apa, uh -huh. Nani and and, and Nani Kenyans kweli. themselves, Kenya Mr. President, wanaumia. Wa Kenya wanasikiza pia huyu anasema hivi huyu anasema tuliza boli <laughs> tumelituliza nani nasema hivi kweli nisikizeni nimesema hivi nataka kuwajibu nyinyi wote watatu mm -hmm. mimi nimesema if you read my statement i said our economy today is out of debt distress and that is the truth for your information if i didn't step in let me even say if i wasn't president the kind of decisions I have made, very difficult decisions, you know, very painful decisions. Decisions that I know they will cause pain, but it is better we make those decisions now than get Kenya into that distress. There are almost eight countries in our continent, including one that went into debt distress. I don't want to mention countries, you know them, last almost three weeks. Or, or one month. That is the worst thing that can happen to any country, to go into debt distress. We, have, we are now out of debt distress. Our economy is stable, but the difficult part is still there. We still have to navigate. All we have done is to avoid the cliff, right? That we have avoided because we have negotiated, uh, we have put bricks on expenditure, we have uh, negotiated a, a good package with World Bank, with IMF, with development partners, with bilateral uh, countries, China, Europe, and everywhere. And that's why I have been on the road uh, so many times. People ask, what is he doing? It was necessary for me to step in and stabilize so that Kenya does not go into debt distress. Mm -hmm. let, me, let, me, let me tell you what Ndungu was saying. Dungu was in parliament. That's actually where That's I was right. headed. He says the Dungu government was, Dungu is was broke. In, Dungu was in parliament. Mm. And he was being pushed. Oh, you need, you need to do this more. Dungu was telling them, look, we don't have the kind of money you're talking about. We don't have money to increase this and to increase this and to increase this. That, that, that is the correct position. Mm. We have, and that is why we are cutting back on many aspects. Because... This is what is required at um. this point in time. It is the difficult decisions we have to make now so that tomorrow looks better. Now, Mwishimu Ares, ufafanuzi wako wa uchumi kumumarika ni nini wakati ambapo wa Kenya wengu wa Amerikia garame ya mwishimu. And you see, what Musalia is saying mm. is for us to be able to get to a place where we can say we are good. You know, that things are moving, there is money in the pocket, we can feed ourselves, we can do everything. It takes time. Mm -hmm. Right? How long? And it takes time. Because <laughs> How long, you, Mr. President? You want me to say three months, five months, one year. No, you're quoting Relax. your Prime Cabinet oh, Secretary Relax. who says Relax. two to three years. Relax. Yeah. Because About we are not in charge of all the factors that will finally determine where we are going, let us give ourselves time. No. But I want to promise the people of Kenya that we will sort this situation out. Mwishimu Arez, unaposema uh, utumi umemarika. Ufafanuzi wako utumi kumemarika ni nini? Hasa wakati ambapo wakenya wanalamikia karame ya maisha. 